How, how's, how's life been for the last couple of months? Really good, really good. I've done a lot. I didn't come out of EastEnders thinking I was going to work, but I have, you know. I've done practically every interview show that, that there is to do, which has been great. Because, you know, I could talk about EastEnders. I could talk, I didn't want to talk about it before I left, you know, but I could talk about it after. Because, you know, I still get a bit emotional. But it's been great, absolutely lovely, you know. I mean, you must you miss the sort of camaraderie on the set. I do, and I saw the girls on uh, Friday night. We had a dinner together, and they very sweetly treated me. And I said, no, it's my treat. They said, no, 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 because we're treating you because it means we, you'll have to pay for dinner, and then we'll see you again, which I think is lovely. And I'll never... I have great friends down there. We talk regularly, so... And are you looking forward to watching the Christmas EastEnders this year? And you won't, you'll know it won't be you. Yes, of course. Yes, I, I, I watch it every Christmas. I shall be watching Coronation Street. I can't. I'm a big soap fan. I, I know what goes on. <laughs> I'm just going to miss that there isn't going to be Peggy throwing someone out of the pub on Christmas Day. I know, I know. It's, it's, it's funny that. Funny me having a catchphrase. You know, it used to be carry on, and, and now it's get out of my pub. I still get it in the street. Yeah. <laughs>